Hello friends, welcome to our next class. In this case, we're going to begin the most important part of the installation process. In this part, we're going to configure our logical volume manager, logical volumes and rate if we need. Uh, so let's go to select the mana, manual mode, sorry, the manual mode. So uh, before the manual mode, we have uh, two other entries with LBM. Uh, we don't going to use it right now. So let's uh, let uh, select uh, the manual mode, please, for our configuration or for began our uh, configuration process. Uh, well, I here I am uh, show you the other two uh, options, please only select the manual mode okay only the manual mode why because uh, we're going to use this uh, with uh, without help of the operating systems okay in this screen uh, we're going to create a new our new devices okay uh, in your screen you're going to see uh, the same options okay uh, like guided partitioning okay uh, sorry i'm going to uh, clear my uh, my disk because I have another installation here uh, let's wait for uh, for that okay look I have now uh, my free space my 8.6 gigabyte uh, free space that is the the disk that I, I am using right now from the virtual box so like you can see uh, well uh, we have a guided partitioning uh, uh, the configure software rate, configure the logical volume manager. That's going to be our uh, our uh, selections. Okay, uh, configure encrypted volumes and configure ISCOSI volumes. So please select configure the logical volume manager uh, in this moment. Press enter. Okay. If you are in the pre in, in in the next screen, please uh, wait for uh, for 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 me. Okay. Okay. In this part, uh, we're going to say yes. Okay. Write the change to this and configure the LBM. Please press enter. And remember that uh, the logical volume manager can be configured. Uh, the camera partition schema has to be brightened to this. This change cannot be undone. Uh, undone. Sorry. Uh, press yes. Okay. Let's wait. Okay. Here we are seeing our partition this screen. In our next class, we're going to configure our volume groups and logical volumes. Uh, for begin our installation okay or uh, for our uh, file systems so uh, let's wait for uh, for the for the finish of this part and uh, please wait for the next class